Hello everyone. Welcome to session 35 of security testing video series. In this session, we are going to continue with the security testing basics where I am going to explain about WASP top 10 vulnerabilities. So let's get started. In the previous session, I explained about what is OWASP. OWASP is a non-profit organization whose objective is to encourage all the organizations to improve their software security, right? This is what I explained in the previous session. Now in this session, we are going to focus on this top 10 vulnerabilities that are published by this OWASP. So if you go to the official website of OWASP, like this OWASP.org, under projects, you can see OWASP top 10, okay? If you go to this particular page, it will display, okay? All the top 10 vulnerabilities as per this year, 2021. These are the top 10 vulnerabilities, guys. So OWASP organization publishes this top 10 vulnerabilities, okay? Publishes this top 10 vulnerabilities for every, like uh, they will update this list of top 10 vulnerabilities every three or four years, guys, okay? This list will keep on changing, guys. Every three or four years, they will do a lot of extensive research and come up with the list of top 10 vulnerabilities, okay? That a uh, lot of softwares are facing in the market. So now as per this date, okay? As per the 2nd February, 2021, these are the top 10 vulnerabilities guys, okay? First one is injection. Second one is broken authentication. Third one is sensitive data exposure, XML, external entities, XXE, broken access control, security misconfiguration, cross-site scripting, insecure deserialization, using components with known vulnerabilities, insufficient logging and monitoring. Okay, these are the top 10 vulnerabilities as per today's date, guys. So this list may change in the next coming years, right? In next uh, two or three or four years, this list will get on, keep on updating, guys. Okay, OWASP organization will update this list. Now, guys, as we are getting started, as we are getting started with this uh, security testing learnings, right? We are almost done with the security testing basics, but now we are in a position to learn all these vulnerabilities, guys. Okay, we are we reached a kind of level where which reached a kind of level or we obtained some knowledge where now we can start working with this vulnerabilities, different vulnerabilities, understanding these vulnerabilities, okay? Uh, what exactly they are and how to identify these vulnerabilities in the web applications. Everything we are going to learn, each and every vulnerability will be explained, okay? Each of each and every one of these top 10 vulnerabilities will explain, will be explained in detail one after the other one in a detailed and practical way with lots and lots of examples, guys, so that you'll get enough confidence in and identifying this kind of vulnerabilities in the uh, web applications that you are testing. So don't uh, perform this uh, vulnerability assessment on any random application, guys, as I already mentioned, okay? As already mentioned, if you perform this kind of, if you try to identify this kind of vulnerabilities on any random application that you don't have permissions for, you may even land up in jail, guys. That is very illegal, guys, okay? Just take that seriously. Uh, anyhow, I'm going to give you some sample or demo applications, guys, where you can practice and find this kind of vulnerabilities, okay? So first, we'll start learning the top 10 vulnerabilities of OWASP. Later, whatever the other remaining vulnerabilities that we have to know as security testers, we'll be learning. Apart from top 10, there are many other vulnerabilities also, guys. Everything will be covered for you in the upcoming sessions. So one more thing you have to remember, guys, okay? So it's very, like, uh, generally, you get a interview question, like, where interviewer will ask you like, uh, what are the top 10 vulnerabilities as per today? Okay, as per today's date, uh, what is the list, latest list of uh, top 10 vulnerabilities in the market? Then you should be in a position to answer this guys. Okay, injection, you should remember all these names. Okay, at least you have to remember all these names so that you will be able to answer that particular question in an easier way. Injection, broken authentication, sensitive data exposure, XXE, XML external entities, broken access control, Okay, so then security misconfiguration, cross-site scripting, insecure deserialization, using components with known vulnerabilities, insufficient login in month. Keep on, keep on, okay? So till you complete learning all these top 10 vulnerabilities, keep on remembering this guys every day. Just try to remember like first injection then, okay? Like that, try to remember all these vulnerability names. Fine. So hope guys you understood like uh, what exactly we are going towards, okay? Now we are getting started with this top 10 vulnerabilities will start learning one after the other vulnerability in a detailed and practical way with lots of lots of examples and practice guys in upcoming sessions. So that's it for this session guys. Uh, in the next session we'll start with the first uh, top 10 vulnerability which uh, falls into the category of this injection. Okay, we'll discuss what exactly this injection is and uh, uh, we'll, uh, we'll go with lots of lots of examples also, okay? Like to practice uh, that particular injection. So that will happen in the starting from the next uh, session. 
so so theoretical sessions are almost uh, done guys now we are moving into the practical sessions so that's it for this session guys thank you bye